We'll guide you through how to fix an SSD not showing up in disk management. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This can be super annoying as it means you can't go and access the space. Make sure you watch this full video so you can know the different fixes you can try. So first of all, do just make sure the SSD is properly connected. So make sure the cable is working. You can verify the cable by using it with another drive. And if it's definitely working, plug it all in. After you've done that, turn on your computer, come to disk management and go and see if it's now appearing. If it is, then great. If it still isn't, then what you need to do is come down to the bottom of your computer and click on search and type in storage spaces, just like so, and click on manage storage spaces. And if there is an existing storage pool here, what you need to do is go and delete it. People have said when there's a pool there, it goes and stops it from showing up. So try deleting it. Then once you've done that, you can come back to disk management. You can click on action and click on refresh and go and see if it then goes and appears. If it does, then great. However, if it still doesn't, or if you didn't have any storage space or pools, then try restarting your computer. To do that, you can click on the Windows button at the bottom, come over to the right and click on the power button and tap restart. A lot of people have said that can solve the problem for them. When it starts again, come back to disk management and go and see if it's now appearing. Hopefully it is. And what you also need to do once it's appearing is go and allocate the space to be able to go and use it in File Explorer. So you can right click on it, click on use simple volume and click on next, press next. You can choose the drive letter and press next adjust the settings, you don't have to, and then press next, press finish, and it'll go and allocate the space, and then it'll go and be appearing in your file explorer. 